Dear and I just got our bowls at Alchemy and we get the same thing. This is the Chunky Monkey Bowl. And it is to die for. It is so good. Let's get our first bite reaction. So good. <laughs> <laughs> so good. Okay. We just made it to where are we? Uh, Ohio <laughs> Vintage Fest. We're at the Road Center mm -hmm. in Columbus, Ohio. Mm -hmm. And um, the kid who put this together went to high school with me. His name's Sam. He's a really good Depop seller. And so he's organized this. We went last January. And we both ended up with some things that we love. So we're excited to see what they have this time. And we brought tote bags <laughs> to put everything in. So... We'll check it out. Hey, we're gonna show you what we got. Jo, you can start if you want. Okay. Um. Well, the first thing I got was this. Uh, I brought a black T-shirt. They were doing a screen printing, um, like station, so you could. They had like three graphics to choose from, and you could get a screen printed on a shirt. So I got Ohio Vintage Fest. We have to Fest. do a close up. Sorry. I'll, I'll hold it. Okay. You can talk. About I got Ohio Vintage Fest screen printed on really the front. Really cool. And then on the back, I got this cowboy graphic, which I think is also just so sick. really cool. And that was really cool. So that would cost me ten bucks, but two graphics, ten bucks. He brought the T-shirt, so that was really fun. And then the next thing I got was I got this shirt for five bucks. It's just like really thrashed and faded. There's like some holes on the back can see probably not because I'm just dropping it but it's just really thrashed and faded but for five bucks I thought it was definitely worth it and then <laughs> um, I got these two t-shirts sorry I got like so many t-shirts I got this bike week t-shirt got a huge graphic on the back for ten bucks and then I got that from the same place that I got this t-shirt for 10 bucks as well so this is like just this another bike week tee daytona beach it's just cool i liked the vintage wash it's like very gray and then last couple things i got was this hat i got for 10 bucks it's just a vintage camel hat definitely needs washed but and the last thing i got was this green like forest green crew neck which i also got for 10 bucks so most of my items were 10 bucks, but definitely glad I got them all. We have a whole new wardrobe of like graphics. Yeah. I only got two things. This was the first thing I picked up. Um, I think I paid $20 for this. It's just an old crew neck. I really like the graphic and it is kind of faded, but I love, I love that. So there's that one. And then I also got this one, which was also $20. This is... That's embarrassing. <laughs> I'm gonna roll up the window. <laughs> um, so this is the front, super old and distressed, which I love, all on the ribbed collar. And then same thing with like both cuffs. But the front says Hogs Breath is better than No Breath at all. And it's for the Hogs Breath Saloon in Cancun. So that's the back. And that's it. Breakdown. Oh no, wait. I can't even switch it out. Go ahead and do your outfit. Uh, so I'm wearing all my jewelry, all my rings. Um, so good. And then vintage West Coast chopper shirt and then some Carhartt work pants that I thrifted and just some Converse. And I got this jacket from Goodwill Bins the other day. Jewelry, tank top, athletic skirt, socks and sneakers. That's about it. JR and I just stopped at the thrift store on our way home. And I got three things. JR got nothing because they keep racking up their prices. <laughs> um, but I got this little wallet. Um, let's see if I can do it on them. What's that? It has a pocket here. A pocket in here. It's genuine leather. And then a pocket here, which 
much even comes up into this envelope. This one was 90 cents. Pretty cute. And then I also got a pair of jeans. These were $5. And they have this detail all the way down the leg on both sides on the front. And the way that I was wearing them, they're a little bit oversized for me, so I wore them low waisted and they like stack at the ankle, which I love. And then the last piece I got was this jacket. This was on sale for $3. It's an old Massimo jacket. It's super cute. Um, I have to do like a try on something or other, but these are the cute uh, cuffs. It has the same thing going on down here. And then it zips up. It's this grayish brown corduroy and it has the option to snap these across the neck or you can just wear it down like a collar like that. So Pretty cute and I was happy to find these because everything else was so expensive. Girl, oh, and there's Roman. There's Roman. Hi. Oh, bye. Yes, yes. Those are all of our finds today, Lulu. Oh, you're so crazy. You're crazy. Hi vlog, we just um, ate leftovers for dinner and this is, wait, should I be doing it this way? At least the sunglasses make it look like out of my face. Hi vlog, <laughs> I had that on video. Hi vlog. We just had leftovers for dinner and we spontaneously got found drinks from Bibby Bop because they're yeah. kind of to die for. All of their teas are really good. Um, what were you going to say? I was just going to say they're goji berry teas. So maybe. Yeah, and so while we were home beforehand, I did um, some work. I'm doing a drop of rat tail sunglasses tomorrow so I had to prep some photos and promote those on my Instagram. I'm gonna try to show so yeah the weird thing with this is you can't like flip back and forth like you can yeah. every other camera. Let's see. So Maybe these I'll... are the colorways that I'm offering with my first opening of uh, made to order slots. These ones are platinum. This is like a medium brown, and then these are like the original deep brown, so I'm super excited. Tonight, JR is going to help me <laughs> with setting up a form to sort of figure that stuff out, and then it, they go live tomorrow, so I'm looking forward to that, and we're just at Whole Foods now, because we're going to go look for some desserts. <laughs> Why he will cry? I know. He's <laughs> having a rough night. Hi vlog. It's the next day, Sunday. Um, it's been sort of relaxed, uh, and we kind of stayed inside as it rained all day today. But um, other than that, we've been pretty productive today. I dropped my order forms for my rat tail sunglasses. And I've already gotten some orders on those, so I'm really excited about that. And that'll give me something to do this week. I'll make those and uh, ship them out. But I tried to show you yesterday, I might still have to insert these photos, but these are the rat tail lenses. The platinum, medium brown, and deep brown that I um, released, and so I'll probably have my order form up for a little bit longer and then take it down so I can get down to work on those. Um, and JR has just been listing some of his items on eBay, so we're both kind of 
trying to get stuff done. And as the evening sort of closes out, I got a notification that Devin Lee Carlson uploaded a video. So I will be spending my evening watching that and sort of just relaxing. Okay, they did this last time. Roman. Oh, Roman. Oh my God. Holy ass.